What's going on all you gamers? If you're playing Remnant 2 and you've made it to this point right here, part of the Lossom questline where you're trying to find a Nightweaver, you may well be in the Shattered Gallery and wonder exactly what to do or what rewards you're going to be able to get from this puzzle. If you need to know the answer to that, then stay tuned. That's coming up next. Welcome back everybody, we're back in Remnant 2, we've managed to take out all of the baddies that were in front of us in this massive gallery, and now either side of us we've got a whole bunch of torches that are either lit by white or blue flames. What exactly do we do here, and when we do complete it, what rewards are we able to get? So the first thing you're going to have to decide, do you want them all to be white, or do you want them all to be blue, as you will get two different rewards, which I'll show at the end. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to be changing them all to white. If you want the blue rewards, then just try and do the kind of same thing, but change them all obviously to blue. But this is probably one of the slightly simpler puzzles in the game, and all it's going to be, every time you shoot at one of these torches, it's going to change the flame's colour, but if there's any flames next to it that are lit, then they're going to change to the opposite colour. I found the best way changing it white was to go all the way to the very end of the right hand side one and shoot at the first blue flame. That's going to change this one white and the one next to it blue. Next I skipped a flame and went straight to the middle flame, shot that one that was blue at the time and that's going to mean that it's going to change to white. Making the two next to it, one change to white on the right hand side and the one on the left changing to blue. Next we're going to travel all the way to the end shoot that one and it's going to mean both of them turn white. So we've now got one complete side of white and we've just got to tackle the other side in order to make this perfect. Next up you're going to go straight over to the other side, you're going to go right to the very middle flame which is going to be the white flame, you're going to shoot at this and change it straight to blue and the colours next to it they're going to turn to white. Then you're going to make your way all the way to the very end, it doesn't really matter which way you start at but all the way to the very end shoot the last torch there which is a white one and both of them are going to turn blue and then you, and where you see the three blue torches lit in a row now you're going to shoot the middle one and that's going to change all of these to white again completing the puzzle and making sure that every torch is going to be white obviously if you want the other reward you'll change them all to blue and I'll show you what the rewards are in just a moment now just at the end of this hall this door is now opened up enabling you to walk through you're going to be able to go straight in there will be a few enemies from what I remember here so you will have to tackle them and just at the very top here is going to be your reward. All of the white one is going to give you the white pawn stamp reward which is a ring and if you change them to blue it's going to be the exact same thing but the blue version which again is going to be another ring. I'm going to chuck on their stats exactly what they do now so that you can decide which one is the one you want to go for. But yeah hopefully that's helped a few of you guys and girls out. Let me know in the comments if there's any amazing weapons or anything you think that I should be looking out for because I'm having an absolute blast with this game and really enjoying collecting some of the items. But as always, for all things gaming, take care. I'll see you on the next day.